Don the Bean and welcome back to some more Fullcraft. Yes, we are back here on the server and today we are joined by Podge and Athanasius. Um, guys, if you're still enjoying this series then please do hit that like button down below. Also, if you're new to my channel, then please do subscribe for daily Minecraft videos. Uh, please do share and tell all your friends and family and stuff like that. And, and hit that like button as well, that really does help. Uh, anything you can do really does help out a lot. Um, but if you want to come and join the server, then all you have to do is head on over to Patreon. The link is in the description down below. And uh, yeah, you can come and play with us guys here on the Fullcraft server and also the Age of Engineering server. And while we're talking about Age of Engineering, uh, I know I'm supposed to be doing that today, uh, but I really wanted to do Fullcraft because... Um, I've been busy and I'm, I'm working towards getting this infinity armor and uh, yeah, I would like to uh, to try and do that if I can um, But anyway, let's talk about what I've been doing off camera Okay, so first of all we have a diamond farm set up here now these seeds aren't 10 10 10 like I was showing you last episode uh, these are literally just uh, normal seeds and as you can see they're they're growing pretty much instantly um, yeah, the the farmer is is keeping up. Uh, they're growing really well, actually. I'm I'm quite impressed. How are we doing for? Because uh, I think this this has seeds. Yeah, so this is filling up ever so slightly. We need to start voiding off all these seeds and stuff. I think. Uh, are they going into there? They're not, but they can get sent into there. Uh, there we go. Cool. Right. So I've got this diamond farm set up because um, uh, we'll, we'll get to that in a moment uh, because <laughs> I made a farm in the end uh, and I'm going to go and show you that now. So if we, uh, yeah, let's, let's get my charge port to take me to the end farm. This is it. Uh, I have an end farm set up purely for gold right now and it's not finished. It's not finished at all. Wow. This... Oh yeah, this farm stopped because I have produced so much gold and I've only just started doing all these uh, these growth uh, accelerators. I need to add to those today. Um, but this farm is stopped because it's full and because it's full over, over here. All of this is full. All this needs to go back uh, to my base. So what I've done is basically... Uh, I haven't finished putting these around yet because I, I didn't have enough diamonds to make them uh, and bone and all that like I should have everything now um, so we can finish this off today and hopefully we can make so many of these we can add to it and make it so that it's an instant growing farm uh, but what this is set up to is literally it's just a farming station with a paper mattock in it uh, this one's got luck on it as well um, yeah, so the mattock um, is, uh, sorry, the farming station is powered by the uh, the energy cell or advanced power cell here. Uh, as you can see, that's powering that. And then we've got an item conduit set to extract, always active. Um, and that sends all of the items into this ender chest, which then uh, sends it back home. Well, this ender chest is marked yellow, yellow, yellow because it's set for gold. So if I go home... Uh, let's go back to my charge portal, please. Um, sometimes I scroll too quickly and it, it, it comes out of there. So if I go home um, and show you, uh, this is what I've got set up to make all of this into blocks. So uh, we have the end of the chest, which we just saw in the, in, the, uh, in the end. Yellow, yellow, yellow. This goes into a mechanical crafter from Extra Utilities 2. Um, and that is piped out, always active, all that business. And then in here, it is set to auto craft one recipe and it has 20 speed upgrades. Um, those 20 speed upgrades make it craft even faster. Uh, so yeah, we're, we're full on gold, as you can see. Um, and if you see here, I've added uh, 15 speed upgrades as well, so it pulls them out quickly. Also a basic item filter to just filter out gold ingots so it doesn't pull out like the gold essence. And then up here, uh, if I can somehow show you, what is that flow? Oh, it's just telling you that it's making gold. Uh, up here, uh, we've got another basic item filter, and that is set to pull out fertilized essence and gold seeds and they get voided off because I've got no use for them uh, so then that gets put into this compacting drawer the compacting drawer compacts gold 
from ingots down to nuggets and makes blocks. That is pulled out of here and then put into here and we have our gold blocks. Now the next step in this is to make the neutronium, new, neutronium compressor. To compress these ingots down, uh, these blocks down, and then turn them into singularities, and that is what we're going to try and do today. Um, so um, I need to show you the recipe for this thing. It is pretty much insane. It really is. Um, I'll show you that in a moment. But first off, I would like uh, growth. Uh, I need to auto craft some of this stuff. So let's auto craft a stack of those. I should be able to do this now. What am I missing? Oh, uh, really? I've only got 46. Okay. So we're going to need to automate. Um, wow, I really can't make that many. Let's do five. Yeah, we'll, we'll craft five for now. Uh, and if I take those out of there, I want to auto craft an absolute ton of these things. Um, there we go. Let's just do uh, that many. We should. Missing. Okay. Okay. You, you, you're playing a silly game here. Let's do uh, 800 then. <laughs> okay. Let's do 500. There we go. 512. Yes, thank you. Right. Make 512 of those for me. Um, so, let's talk about the Neutronium Compressor. It compresses down blocks of gold and blocks of certain items that we need. Uh, to make the infinity uh, armor and the world breaker and all that lot. Uh, notice my new door? Yes, thank you to Big Daddy J. He has made me an infinity ingot door. And has done a bit of decorating around the place. Because he said, my base is winding him up. Um, I don't know what he's talking about, but it looks nice. Uh, so here we go into my base. Uh, another thing I've set up is loot bag opening automatically. So loot bags are automatically pumped into here. Uh, this is just for me to open them manually if I wanted to. But loot bags automatically come into here. They get opened up and then it gets sent into my uh, my system. So if I type loot, I shouldn't have... Uh, oh, really? All of these, I believe have been opened and oh no i don't want that that's why um they're in the system i believe uh, let me throw those back in can i put these uh in here yeah there we go get them open out of the way there we go uh so that'll automatically open them for me and there's a cooldown on it but i've got that many it just opens them automatically so anytime my mob spawner picks up a loot bag uh it'll automatically come into these guys and get opened um, so yeah, so that's a thing. Uh, we're still making infinity ingots. Yeah, th that's that's a thing that's still happening. Uh, I think we've got enough now, to be honest. And Big Daddy J has come along and he sorted out all of my power issues. Um, yeah, he, he's an absolute star, honestly. Um, yeah, so I think that's pretty much it. Now time for this. Get a load of this place. What do you think of this? <laughs> now, I've not done any of this. This is all Big Daddy J. Uh, he, um, he said he was fed up of seeing my dirt and stone. And every time I looked up, you could see cables and stuff like that. Um, so he decided to decorate my base for me, which thank you very much, sir. It's very kind of you. He's also upgraded this uh, to the... Um, the, the next tier or the highest tier of conduits i think the yeah the vibrant capacitors um so yeah so he's he's upgraded all my stuff he's even set me up a uh, a woot farm thing so i can switch my woot farm up for on and off here and he set the power to fifty thousand. uh so my woot farm will still continue to run but uh just at a slower rate which is awesome um, yeah, I think he's done a fantastic job. Um, I really do appreciate it. And over here, we've got Essence Auto-Crafting. So, all of my Essence gets auto-crafted over here. Can you believe that? Um, that's just crazy. It is just crazy. Um, so, yeah. So, thank you very much, Big Daddy J, for doing that for me. I really do appreciate it, honestly. Um, I can't thank you enough. And it looks like I've got room to put in more drives. So that's good. Um, right, okay. So, uh, how are we doing with the uh, the grow? Oh, this is um, 
my diamond essence at the moment. Uh, we have 87,000 Dragon's Breath, so we can use the Halitosis Generators. Uh, 74,000 Neverstars and 189,000 Infinity Ingots. Oh yes, we are so rich right now. Uh, but I was working on this Neutronium. I left those loot bags. Uh, shall I just open these quickly? Let's just open these quickly. Um, new I was working on the uh, Neutronium Compressor. I want to make this guy. Um, and what I need to do is... Let's get rid of this junk. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Goodbye. And goodbye. Is that it? Is that all of it? I think that's all of the junk out of the way. So what I need to do is head on over to here, and back here I have myself some Neutronium Collectors. I have, I think it's 16, uh, what's that, 4, 8, 12, 15, 16, yeah, 15. I got 15. No, that's, that's more than that, isn't it? That's 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 21! Uh, and in here is a load of this pile of Neutrons, which I should have finished collecting them all now. Yes, I have, good. Um, so... The Neutronium uh, collectors are a little bit on the expensive side. Uh, let me let me just uh, explain this to you. N e uh, uh, n e u is it? I think yeah. Okay. Uh, so this is the recipe. So we need the crystal matrix ingot, which is diamond lattice. Diamond lattice is five diamonds. Um, then you have two never stars, which makes this. I need uh, seven of those, plus all this redstone and blocks of iron and all of that. And I've made 21 of them, um, which is a fair few. Still not enough, but it's a fair few. Um, now I need to make this thing, the Neutronium Compressor, which is more blocks of iron. Uh, I'm going to need four, eight, ten uh, crystal matrix ingots. I'm going to need uh, 3, 6, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 Neutronium ingots and one Neutronium block plus a block of redstone and uh, it's just a load of iron and these three hoppers. I need to make this thing right now. Uh, so what I'm going to do is hopefully, uh, if I clear that out and do this, uh, whoops, I should have enough to make what I need so the pile of neutrons turn into nuggets there we go we got 64 there and 8 so 8 should make 9 that's gonna give me one extra ingot so that's 7 I need to make 8 out of this I'm not gonna ah 7 I am one ingot short <laughs> to making this let me check uh, 3 6 12 13, 14, 15, 16. I need, I need 16. So, I think what I might do is nip over to Big Daddy J's and just see whether he's got one of these ingots spare. Um, because I don't think, yeah, I'm not, I'm not collecting anymore. These take forever uh, to get collecting. So, hopefully he might have some of that. Uh, we'll do that. We'll nip over there uh, in a second. So, let's get everything, um... No, let's go over there now. Let's let's go to his base, and um, we're going to see if he's got anything that I can just borrow. I just need one ingot, and I, and hopefully he doesn't mind. Um, I can always give it him back. That's that's no problem. Uh, right, okay. Um, uh, N E U. Oh, really? You don't have any neutronium at all. Hmm. Do you have uh, Neutronium Collectors anywhere? The Celestial Manipulator. Very cool. Um, okay. Um, yeah. What is that thing? He has none. No. Yeah. That looks like my base, and that looks like my base. Wonder what he's up to then. Um, come on, dude, you got to have a neutronium collector somewhere. What's this? Connected screens, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, all right. Well, I'll go on the hunt. I'll go and see whether Ant's got uh, uh, one neutronium ingot. Let me let me ask him. Uh, Ant, do you have a? 
to Ronium ingots, I could borrow, please, will pay you back. Let's see whether he can help me out. Hopefully he can. Hopefully we can do this. Um, and, and Big Daddy J sorting out the lag at his base. It's wool. Wool. What is that? Awakened Draconian Block. It's a tier 8 energy core. Almost infinite. What is that number? Is that 2 billion? No, that's 206... 2.643 trillion. RF a tick. No, not RF a tick. RF stored. That is insane. I like that. Um, right, okay. Let's, um, let's head home. There we go. Um, so, I'm kind of stuck, really. I need this... Yeah, we'll be over in a sec to give it to you. Okay, what I'm going to do then is I'm going to disappear just for a second. We'll wait for Ant to come and drop over uh, this Neutronium ingot. And then uh, I'll get everything ready to start crafting. And um, yeah, we'll be back shortly. I'll see you in a bit. Okay, so thank you, Ant. <laughs> um, he gave me a few more than I actually needed. Uh, I think, what was that, nine he's given me? That's plenty, thank you. Uh, so, we're going to need some iron blocks. So let's make... Uh, an absolute crap ton of these quickly. Uh, I've got enough iron for days, so it's no problem. Um, three, four, that'll do uh, for the iron blocks. Uh, then we're going to need some hoppers. Oh, I've got, I got a few of those. That's good. One, two, three of those. And um, we're going to need some of those uh, ingots, aren't we? So, ingot. Let's have a look and see if it's on the crafting list. It is. No, ah, there it is. Right, Crystal Matrix ingot. Uh, so I've got seven. Let's do. Uh, let's do ten. Yeah, that'll be fine. Ten of those for now. And I think that was it. Let's have a look. Let me just check. Uh, yes, yeah, so there's uh, two blocks of redstone. That's easy enough. That is easy. Redstone it is then. Yeah, I think we can afford two. There we go. And uh, let's just have a look for those, um, what are they called again? Crystal Matrix. There we go. There's my 10. Awesome. Right, cool. We are good to go. Uh, now, the good thing about this uh, Avarita? Avarita, I believe that's what it's called. Um, um, crafting is you can now shift click in so if we type in collector uh, and grab this guy like this we should be able to um how come no 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 not collector we want compressor that's what we're after the neutronium compressor uh, so we should be able to shift click in like that and that will get me what I'm after. Right, so now we've got this set up. Uh, what we're going to do is head on out to my uh, my little farm out here. And get this all... Whoa, bit of a lag spike there. Uh, get this all connected up and actually get this cold farm working. Right, so uh, what we need to do then is... I've never used one of these before, but I'm assuming I can just place this down and it will put in whatever it needs to start compressing into an ingot. So if I connect that like that and we'll click extract always active and turn that on to insert, that should now start putting in, please, gold. Please. Don't tell me I have to do this manually. I really don't want to be doing this manually. No. No. Let, let me just, let me check. Right. So that is not filling. Why are you not filling? Extract, always active. Insert. 
Kennel Green. Does it need to be... Whoops. Does it need to be... Insert that way. I believe that is working. I am quite impressed with that. So, as long as I put some speed upgrades on there, which we can do, um, we can speed that up massively. Um, let's type S P E D. Uh, where are you guys? We'll put these speed upgrades on. Um, let's do 15 like we did on the last one. Um, and that should send in the stuff uh, very very quickly so if I put that on here where are you where are you where are you there you go uh, that should start filling up a lot quicker yeah there we go that's cool uh, so that has got to fill up with 10,200 blocks and what I'm gonna get out is a golden singularity from Avarita right okay so uh, that's fine and I'm looking forward to that but I need somewhere to store them, and uh, there's there's 12 different singularities uh, to be placed into these uh, crafting things here. Um, now the reason I'm just going to put them in here for now because it's easy storage, and I haven't actually used storage drawers of this in this full craft yet. It's it's all been um, it's all been done by. Uh, Refined storage, and I fancied something different. So let's uh, let's see if we can find a way through. Oh, come on, come on! There's got to be a better way than this, please. Okay, looks like we're going down. Because I want to be able to extract out of there. Let me just grab. It's going to save me some time. One more. There we go. Right, cool. Uh, so, if we grab this, and if we do that, and then we're going to tell it to extract, always active. Hopefully, uh, you can pull from the bottom. I'm kind of hoping that's a thing. Uh, will that connect? Yes, it will. Uh, we'll send this down here then. Uh, don't worry about that one. It's fine. I'm rich. And then... Ah, I was stuck. I was. I'm, there we go. Um, and then what I'm going to do is put a draw controller here, so the draw controller can decide uh, where stuff goes. And then put this like this. Break that off. That there. That there. And we'll break that off. And then we'll set that mm. to insert. So any singularities I get now. Which I should get, because let's be honest, um, this system is kind of automated. Kind of. Hmm. Um, no. No, I don't want you to connect. I don't like that. I haven't, uh, I haven't even got my wrench on me. Uh, let me go and grab my wrench. Let's, let's do this properly. Because, you know, Big Daddy J, you put in all the effort for, uh, for this. So let's, um, let's put in the effort. Let's, let's try and um, sort of stick to what he's doing there. Uh, right, let's get rid of those and um, get this up. Right, okay. So we can put this guy here. And then we want to say, no, like that. And we want to say, no, to that one. Right, so that should... In theory, be pumping in plenty of singularity stuffs. It's going to take a while, but eventually, we're at 21%. But eventually, we're going to end up with one gold singularity. And we have to do this all over again. Right, we have actually started draining out. So the farm's now running. So I need to get my farm increased and... Um, and get that actually loaded up. Uh, the other thing I wanted to do was I was going to put some of these upgrades on here because I think, in, in all fairness, I'm only going to need a stack of each. Um, so I'm just going to put some of these upgrades on until I completely mm. run out. And um, 
Yeah, that should do it. Right, let's um, keep going around. There we go. Right, cool. So that, yeah, that's going to take a fair bit. We're looking at Singularity being being born soon. Uh, right, okay. Let's, um, let's get rid of you guys. Uh, I want the draw key. You can go, you can go. Uh, you can go there. You can go back into the system. And I kind of got to keep all of these guys on me. So let's look at uh, growth. All right, so we've got a fair few of them. So we'll take the five that we need. That'll do. And then we can head over to the farm and try and get these going a little bit quicker. Um, but yeah, the plan is to do it. Um, oh, I've gone to the wrong place. The plan is to do this. You can see it working now. Uh, the plan is to do this and get it. I needed more than five of these, didn't I? Uh, <laughs> to get this so that it, it builds things instantly. But once I've made enough gold singularities, um, I then want to move on and make the next tier of singularity. And, and like I said, there's 12 of them. Um, yeah, there's 12 of them. Uh, one being a redstone, a lapis, gold, iron... Silver, nickel, diamond, emerald, uh, lead, tin, copper, and nether quartz. All of these I'm going to make crops for. And I'm just going to use this one farm, uh, this one farming station, to collect all of that for me. Because I think that's going to be the best way of reducing lag on the server and, um, uh, yeah, and still being able to get uh, what I want. In, in a reasonable time. In a, a reasonable time. How's that affecting the farm now? I mean, we've got to be close to Insta-growing, surely. I think we're doing good. Uh, but guys, anyway, I'm going to leave it there. Um, if you did enjoy, uh, then please do hit that like button down below. Also, if you're new to my channel, then uh, hit that subscribe button. Turn on uh, post notifications and all that so you'll be the first to know when I post a video and um, yeah if you want to come and join the server then head on over to Patreon uh, link is in the description down below and if you pledge the $5 tier or more you will gain access to this server and the Age of Engineering one uh, but I'm going to leave it there uh, thank you very much for watching I really do appreciate it I hope it's not the bean this has been Fullcraft <laughs>